Santa, what are you doing? Also, he's got Captain America shields on his jacket. Interesting. from the MPD. He came here to ask me about what happened last night. You mean a detective? She's a little too excited for this situation. Wow! I've never As we'll see why before. shortly. Adrenaline level is rising. Date, she's also underage. Or, well, younger than you are, I imagine. I don't know how old Date is. They don't, haven't given a number yet. Is something the matter? No, nothing. Oh. Um. I heard about it. Oh, it's just gonna keep showing the same. To seeing that corpse at Bloom Park? He told me. Tessa. Why didn't you come to the police? Such a shocking story would certainly pique the young woman's yep. interest. The same clip over and over again. Possible Oto wanted her attention. He told her about a dead body he found for attention. Actually, I already knew about it before Ota told me. How? It's all over the internet. When I saw Ota this morning, I asked him about it. He told me he saw the body. You know who this is, right? Yeah, it's the woman I saw at Bloom Park. Her name is Shoko Nadami. Mizuki's mother, but we don't talk about that, I guess. News. Wait. Do you not know who her daughter is? She has a daughter? I didn't know that either. They must be unaware that Shoko is Mizuki's mother. Maybe because her last name is different. Nadami and Okiura. It has also not yet been reported that Shoko is Renju's ex-wife. Hmm. Renju is probably a suspect at this point. Like I imagine, in or at least from watching a lot of crime shows, Gee, Tessa. the husband or ex so is cute. a suspect a lot of the time. And oh boy, he's fanboying over her now. So cute that I can't take it. Don't you think so too, Date? You're awfully familiar with her. I can't help it. Her loving aura is in the air. When I'm with her, I just my head gets all light, and I just relax and don't sweat the small stuff. You know? Ugh. <sighs> Yep. Let me confirm something. Your A set, right? Let's play a game. Shadows. Um, thread, silhouette, A set. Fears. Uh, upset, regret, A set. Water. Wet, sweat. 
Yay! A set, you bet. I don't want to even acknowledge what just happened. The magnetic currents in the atmosphere are clearly causing aberrant behavior. I turned 18 this year. Yeah, she's 18. That is technically of legal age, but still iffy. A senior in high school? Good thought, Iba. Don't worry. I'm not gonna make a move. What? He said that out loud instead of in his head. Whoops. Oh, I meant Ota. Wait, you were gonna make a move on me? <laughs> Mizuki Okiura? Yeah, I am! Mr. Okiura runs the agency, and Mizuki is his daughter. We hang out sometimes. Is that how you became friends? There's more to it than that, but basically. So, Mizuki must come here to hang out sometimes. Like a goddess in a summon thrall. He's even admitted. Oh my god. <sighs> I hate this kid. If Tessa ever I do. Gets in trouble, I swoop in and protect her. <laughs> you sound more like a superhero than a thrall. Ota always defends me when I'm getting bashed online. Stop. You're making me blush. Ooh. Hey, let me tell you something. It's about those posts on Two Witter. Hey. <laughs> Wait. I feel like I could see his soul leave his body at that precise moment. <laughs> huh. Looks like you're my thrall now. Isn't that right, Ota? Yeah, just be cool. I have determined that these two have no further information for us. Our goal is to find the murderer of Shoko Nadami. Let us continue. Right. Let's head back to the crime scene. Hmm? Hmm? See you kids later. Um, where are you going? Back to where the corpse was found. In that case, I'll go with you. That doesn't seem like a good idea. You'll what? Please take me with you. Why? Because I want to know more about what happened. Do you have any suspects? Probably some crazy murderer, right? That's what Oto was telling me. Uh... The corpse was strung up on that merry-go-round. It must have been some kind of twisted message. Do you want me to tell you what we think so far? Oh yeah, then this happens. I love those purple gloves he's wearing. Ota, take a video! Huh? Just do it! Mr. Tate! What? 
What are you doing? Ota, did you get it? Oh, uh, yeah. Manipulative. Hang on. Oh. Just imagining your body sinking into Tokyo Bay. Well, fuck you, do. <laughs> <laughs> I'm used to sinking. I'm part of the job. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, horrible joke. Huh? Mr. Date, you are a member of the MPD, aren't you? A public servant? I wonder, what would happen if this little video happened to go viral? You wouldn't. Yeah, she's... Smarter than she looks. Oh, and just so you know, taking my phone away won't help. It's already in the cloud. You little... I told you! I want you to take me to the scene of the crime. If you do, I promise I'll delete the video. In the words of a famous paleontologist, clever girl. Yeah, this is about where I stopped playing. Pretty much this cutscene right here. So, after this, I don't know what's going to happen. We're good friends. We go to movies and karaoke and go shopping together. She's really good at listening to me bitch and moan about my problems. I'm so much older than her, but it really doesn't even feel like it. Questions. Questions. Ah, what's it like being a detective? Didn't know much about that. I'm not a detective. But I'm not on the crimes unit. Then what unit are you in? What indeed? You aren't gonna tell me? <laughs> Please! Mm. What are you doing? Just thinking about posting that video. Whoa, hold up now. Well then, tell me! You know, now that I think about it, wouldn't you get in trouble for that video too? What? The video. You're an idol, right? You have a status to maintain. If that video went viral, I think you'd be in trouble, too. It's okay. Uh, it is? Because sometime real yeah, this, this dialogue right here, this was the one where I decided... Uh, well, not... I'm going to die. Not decide to stream, but... I wasn't... I don't know, I stopped. see into the future I know when I'm going to die you can see into the future and I thought my seeing eye could see through bullshit 
can see right... <laughs> Oh, just fuck kidding. Sake. I hope so. Anyway, I'm not going down without a fight. So I will release that video if you don't cooperate. I'm part of a special investigation unit known as Abyss. Date. I don't have a choice. What's Abyss? Advanced Brain Investigation Squad. The public doesn't know about it. Wow, cool! Don't tell anyone. I promise I won't. Uh, somehow I don't believe you. I swear to the Egyptian goddess Isis. She wanted young. She wanted men. Hmm. Wait. I'm just gonna let her. I've always wanted to be famous. Okay. I wanted to be famous. Yeah. I want to be famous. Get on TV. Be a household name. You're not there yet. It's all right. Internet stars do better if they don't sell out. Internet star. I didn't tell you? I'm most famous on the internet. I do songs and dances and... So like what I'm doing right now. Only obviously she would get way more viewers than I do. Who wants to see me play video games, am I right? <laughs> uh. Have you heard of Shovel Forge? Minecraft. Shovel. Shovel for. Okay. I've been focusing a lot on that game lately. What about being on TV? I'm not very popular yet. I can only get on TV as a background singer or something. I don't get many gigs either. First, all I did was stream from home. And then, not to sound cocky, but I started getting pretty big. I started getting offers from agencies. And one of them was Lemon Escape? Well, not exactly. Huh? My mom's actually an old friend of the president of the agency. Friend of Renju's? Yeah. As are we. So I asked him for advice one day. You know, you have to be careful. As I keep trying to get my head actually visible. Even a place that looks legitimate with an office and everything can be sketchy. That is true. Mm -hmm. My mom and I didn't know anything about the industry at all. Anyway, one day Mr. Okiura said to come see him at his office, and he hooked me up. By the way, I didn't catch your name. You really want to know? What if I do? It's okay if you don't want to tell me. Iris! I know, weird, right? Ratty cake, ratty cake, baker's man. Bake me a cake. We're as in a flashback. No, 
Apparently we knew her. I'm guessing from that flashback. Yeah, it gets more and more interesting. Excuse me. You Konami Date. That's right. And the girl? She's an important witness for this case. Yep, yep. We've got business here. Oh, uh, okay. Show me the earliest recorded images of the scene of the crime. What is your intention? Shoko's cause of death was blood loss from multiple stab wounds with the ice pick. Naturally, there should be plenty of blood. Agreed. But there isn't a single drop on the horse. It was like this when we found it. Correct. There are no signs of blood being wiped or washed off either. So she wasn't killed here. That must be. I was trying to find some clues. She's a natural detective, huh? Was the body on top of this horse here? Yeah, that's the one. Hmm. Seems like some kind of ritual murder to me. Maybe a religious cult sacrificing her to the devil or something. Interesting leap. They conducted their ritual here. Like shadowy, hooded figures going around and around, stabbing her one by one. That's quite an imagination, but do you have any proof? I do. Well, let's hear it. Last night, Shoko's corpse was on top of the horse. It has been removed. The body has been transported to headquarters for autopsy and review. Younger, but not since it closed. Kabasaki is restricted, right? No one's supposed to be here. This amusement park, Bloom Park, is located at the heart of the Kabasaki. It was closed eight years ago. The closure was due to an accident at a nearby chemical plant. Chemical plant, presumably run by Homer Simpson? explosion caused massive amounts of chemical pollutants to contaminate the area. The government quickly issued evacuation orders. Eventually, the entire district was deemed unsafe for habitation and restricted. Therefore, Bloom Park was permanently closed. But a restricted area doesn't mean much if there aren't enough officers to patrol it. There are still plenty of ways in. You can even get in by boat. Hell, some people ignore the evac order and are still living here. Are they... okay? I don't know. But if anything happens to them, it'd be their own fault. Are we safe? 
We are, yeah. Decontamination for this area is basically done. The chemical concentration around here isn't high enough to hurt you. You could run a marathon here and be okay. But it's still off limits, right? Yes, legally. That keeps the media out, at least. I'm glad. It's quieter than it usually is. Hey, Iris, I don't know what you're trying to accomplish here, but you're wasting your time. What do you mean? The cops already scoured the place. They didn't find any leads, not a single clue. If they had, they would have notified Iva. Iva? My partner. Your partner? I don't see anybody. She is right in front of your eyes. Huh? <laughs> okay. Kind of clever. The horses. Horse? Sounds kind of like Horace, right? What are you talking about? She's you leaping through. Horace? She's taking quite a leap. Egyptian god of the sky and sun. The right eye is the eye of Ra, and that's the sun. The left eye is the eye of Wajet, and that one is the moon. Hey, where have we seen that word before? Oh yeah, we're wearing one. It's the same idea behind the eye of Providence. The eye of Providence? All-seeing eye. God, everything in this game is about eyes. <laughs> Makes for a lot of pun potential. Oh, I see. Just like what's on the back of a one-dollar bill. Yeah, exactly. The Eye of Providence is supposed to be the symbol of Freemasonry and the Illuminati. Starting to see the picture? I mean... The Illuminati, the Marvel Illuminati? Because that would be Not an excuse really. to get Robert Downey Jr. back in the role of Iron Man. I remember Ota describing the scene. He said there was an ice pick stabbed into the corpse's left eye socket. Providence? Left eye? There has to be some kind of meaning to this. Wait, what did you just say? What? The ice pick was inside the victim's left eye socket? Yeah. Ota told you that? He's sure that's what he saw. Yeah. When we arrived at the scene, the ice pick was not in the victim's eye socket. If Ota's telling the truth... He would have no reason to lie about such a detail. Tinazuki? Yeah, I think we should go. No. I'm already in enough trouble bringing a civilian in here. Okay, I guess. Hey, you all right? Are you okay? I don't like what that implies. I'm <sighs> kidding. It's not like I would know. Get on. I'll give you a ride home. Yes, good. My God. Just wondering, but how much do you weigh? Don't you know it's rude <laughs> to ask a lady that? Hundred five pounds. I see. One o five, huh? 
You can tell just by lifting me? Sure. Yeah. Your back is so warm, Mr. Date. 